today I have this really simple eye look that I do almost every single day. It's kind of like my winter everyday makeup. And this is what I usually wear whenever I decide to wear a brown eyeshadow. Whenever I wear silver, it's a little bit different. But if you want my silver everyday eye, then just ask for a tutorial. I'm pretty, I think someone already did. And this hair is driving me crazy. But anyway, this is just my brown smoky eye. I'm using pretty much all Urban Decay eyeshadow products and then. The rest are just drugstore because I like Urban Decay eyeshadows and both one of the palettes I bought and the other palette was a gift. This is from um, Joey so I decided to use it in this tutorial. It had the same color that I did in the makeup palette but I wanted to incorporate it into this tutorial. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay so the first thing I'm doing is priming my eyes with e.l.f. Mineral Eye Primer. And then in this Urban Decay palette I'm using the color Maui Wowie. And I'm applying this color all over my lid using a Urban Decay eyeshadow, like, C brush. Then I'm using the color Smog from the same palette, and I'm going to blend this color into my crease. I'm going to slightly bring it down my outer part of my eyelid, and then I'm using the two colors Hustle and Creep. With these two colors, I'm going to stifle them into my outer corner with Hustle first and then Creep. Taking the color Polyester Bride, I'm going to apply this as my brow bone highlight and my inner corner. I'm going to take smog and apply this onto my lower lash line and just kind of smudge it in. Now using a NYX eyeliner pencil in black, I'm just going to line my waterline and then try to get some of my lower lash line as well. Using L'Oreal Carbon Black Eyeliner Felt Tip. I'm going to apply this as my upper lash line eyeliner by making my eyeliner thicker on the outer part of my eye and especially adding a wing just to give my eye a cat eye effect. Curling my lashes with an elf eyelash curler and applying great lash onto my lashes and my lower lashes as well. I would recommend using a long lengthening mascara for this look. And then that's the last step, you're finished. Thanks for watching.